today we have a 2008 uh, Chevy Suburban Z71 package with a 5.3 motor. It's a 4x4. Um, the idle's inconsistent. The car's been tuned up, but it still varies a little. It's kind of bouncing. So we are going to clean the mass airflow sensor. We're going to show you where that's located and how to do it. Okay, this is your Vortec 5.3. Um, the car was running a little rough. Uh, we put new plugs, new wires in it. Um, so the next thing, we replace the air cleaner. Um, it's still a little rough yet in the mass airflow. There's no check engine lights, but the mass airflow sensors can get dirty. This is where it's located right here. And that uh, has the air coming from your air cleaner through the mass airflow. And it adjusts your ECM as the air comes through. It depends on if it's cold, altitude, whatever. But it adjusts the airflow mixture so the, the motor runs at op optimum performance. We got this one right here. Loosen that up. If you buy a new one, they're any place from like $60 to $130, so it's worth trying to clean it since we don't have a, a PO code on this one yet. Right here, we push down on this tab right here to remove it. Just push down on that. Release it. Okay. It should just pull right off of here like that. That one pulls off of there. Okay, you can see inside there, these actually get dirty. These little wires down there, so we're gonna clean that off. And you, of course, can't just use WD-40 or brake cleaner or anything like that. You actually have to use mass airflow sensor cleaner. Uh, that's made especially for that. So we're gonna clean this and hopefully that helps it. This is something actually you should do every, maybe 20 to 30,000 miles on most cars, just to keep them running at uh, optimum performance which of course would help your gas mileage too. These are really bad sometimes. A car, you can get a no start or a hard start condition. When we install it, you gotta make sure your arrows go in this direction. And you can see this little notch right here. That little notch goes right there. So all we gotta do is put it down here like this, get that started like that. And make sure that this is located right there it on just like that and we'll just tighten those up okay there's that and this is around this like I was saying right there so once that's there tighten this one up Now I sprayed that down, I'll let it sit for a half hour or so. And the last thing I'm going to do right here is plug in a mass airflow sensor. And that's all it takes to clean a mass airflow sensor on a 2008 Suburban with a 5.3 motor.